With her square hair, masculine overtones, and bizarre behavior, Jamaican-born singer Grace Jones has made a lasting impression on the music scene. Gentlemen, I give you Katrina. Now, Jones is exploding on the movie screen where she follows her critically acclaimed performance in A View to a Kill with a new comedy horror vamp where she creates the most unusual striptease vampire to ever draw blood. I figure I might as well have a vampire that doesn't look like any other vampire, meaning she has paintings of herself all over. She's constantly um, changing every five minutes, different hair, different, different eye colors, just having fun because she really is a, a, a narcissist. I'm trying yeah. to see which light I'm to Jones doesn't have any lines in Vamp, so she was forced to rely strictly on her body movements and appearance to create her character. To do so, she enlisted the aid of her friends, including New York artist Keith Herring, who painted her body in his characteristic style. We just collaborated with all my artist friends and uh, put an Egyptian modern day sort of uh, oriental in some some of the scenes it's sort of like african clay different color faces and stuff like that and it just shows all the different lives Ka katrina's been through really katrina provides a living nightmare in this comedy horror but according to director richard wank grace jones was a casting dream grace has brought all her own costumes all the artwork in in, in her room at the nightclub is all her own Andy Warhol pictures and uh, body sculptures. And Grace made the part hers. And she does it in her own inimitable style with vibrance, sensuality, and power. I think women now are, you know, we, we always have been, and just a lot of them haven't realized it, <laughs> that they are powerful, that they are smarter than men, and they are the stronger sex. <laughs> <laughs>